the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. No, oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those... We're going to Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business? FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, well, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. Julio, buenos dias. How are you? Oops. 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 Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Sir, thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. All right, what do we got here? Uh, surveillance and ventilation. Now all I'm after is the alarm. security camera and the alarm system. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. Come back to me. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out.
What time do the clubs close around here? Sure, honey. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Well, ain't it just a small world? What you need to understand about our production company is that we're much more of a... You got like that on... I really don't. Seriously? You'll never know what you'll Okay, my phone's telling me there's some construction around the corner, behind the shop. Let's go there. work I need to see everything get up on the roof so you keep up with the old crew you know after your death slash disappearance there wasn't much holding us together yeah you see him at all after the incident I kept tabs on him for a while needed to uh, know that he didn't blame me I saw a ladder climb up it and see if you can get to the roof yeah where'd he go North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. I'm on the roof! All right, use the glasses to give me a shot of Angelico's roof unit. It'll be right above the store. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. come out. Right, you're well placed to take the photo of the system now. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Let's hurry this up, Michael.
longer, you're risking blowing this whole thing. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Well, nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. The alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window. Someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. Uh, might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. <laughs> you got the Workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Uh, well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Go and leave evidence behind on a hard drive. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we... The exit strategy. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door, or try to play it smart? Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Cho. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Gus Moda. He's a pro, not much else to say. Hacker, back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Harris, <laughs> good, feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. If this is how you want to do it, I'll get moving. Great, uh, I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes, huh? good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful, and the risk will be high. 
but you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you could put together your own deals, your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. You fucking dick. Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. Oh, <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do's your business, bro. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought, maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. You okay there? You got lucky, buddy.
Honey, I'm home. Hey, holla at me, y'all. Peace. Gotta be shared. What? That crazy motherfucker Lamar hasn't got you killed yet? No, not yet. He must be slacking. He's always slacking. He's a fool, bro. Yes, sometimes. Anyway, talking of fools, what would you say if I told you some fools I knew were running a little racing competition? And as luck would have it, they got this really beautiful silver medal with your name on it. I say go fuck yourself. Bronze medal then? <laughs> Funny motherfucker. You racing or watching, Franklin? Okay, let's go! Watch yourself! Screw 
Fury. Bitch-ass bullshit. But you know what? It's getting to be a bit much. I have no idea how you cope. Of course I cope. I'm a woman. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? <laughs> <laughs> but girl, I done done all that I can do. Come on, homie. We ain't got all day. 